What's up everybody? How you guys doing? My name is Christian. This thing's recording and today is October 24th, week number two of season five of Halo Infinite titled Reckoning. Well guys, as you can see, I got a brand new Spartan here. I got the Battle Pass purchased and I want to give a special shout out to Major Attitude who was kind enough to gift a thousand credits here to the Modern Nation for me to purchase the Battle Pass for season five halo infinite so thank you so much so here is this store guys i have 450 credits and that's only because i earned some in the battle pass so i wasn't able to purchase anything luckily for me it looks like the championship bundles are still here so i got another week to trying to come up with some money to uh go ahead and purchase this <laughs> um <clears throat> but let's go back into the store as we can see Sanguine Gift, 2200. This thing looks sick, man. I can't wait to jump into that. For all you PSL lovers out there, we got the Pumpkin Spice here coming into the shop. Those look like some cool shoulder pads. Halloween Hero, this is perfect. Shout out to 343 for actually putting Halloween stuff on the week of Halloween. So a lot of good changes for Halo Infinite for sure. And it looks like the Flood and all the items from last week are going to remain in the shop as well. Steelheart is going to be the half weekly. And then R rate noon is going to be the daily. So let me go ahead and remove this on the screen for you guys. Let's start first with the daily. I actually own this. So if you want to see the price, go on Halo Waypoint or follow Item Shop Halo on Instagram. I really like this coating, guys. I love the pure white look on it. I wish it was cross-core. I wish we could put it on every single vehicle, every single weapon. But I actually might even, even use this nameplate. This nameplate actually does go with my Spartan. I'm going to equip it. I love it. That actually looks really sick. And a lot of people don't have it. I love that black and gold look on it. So I'm a fan of this coating, clearly. I just love how it looks. Look at how clean that looks. Anyways, that's the daily for today. Steelheart is going to be the half weekly. This is going to switch out on Friday. This came out last season with the Steelheart. Check it out right here. This was for your hazmat. So it comes with a pretty much an entire set for your hazmat. And again, guys, with season five, all these helmets are now cross core. So you'll be able to use it. And for those of you that haven't figured it out yet, these little items, these little uh, hexagons at the bottom indicate what is cross core so if you see that on anything that means that it's a cross core coating for your armor or obviously if it's for the weapons it's also cross core for the weapons and you guys get the you guys get the gist so this is 1400 credits guys if you're a fan of that go ahead and purchase it and if you want to see any of these items here from last week from the flood and onward i'll leave a link at the top right of this video go check out last week's video support it give it a like subscribe to the channel do all that good stuff so that modified gaming can continue to bring you this content so let's go into sanguine gift this is going to be a 2200 bundle it's going to come with the kamazots legendary helmet and now cross core that's what it looks like without the attachment i think it looks better with the attachment it reminds me of like Kind of like Catwoman, but like a mask, like kind of like Black Panther, actually. To me, this is like a Black Panther. Look at from the side profile. Oh my god, this thing looks sick, man. It's like a cat or a dog or a beast. I love it. I love it. Like a werewolf, even. So yeah, shout out to the designer of this one, man. This is a sick-ass helmet. You also get the Sanguine Gift. Yo, it's like a little blood pouch. That reminds me of the Scream Halloween costume I used to have as a kid. You push the little heart and a bunch of blood would start squirting out. Yeah, okay, okay. I like this. Yo, a new weapon model for the AR called Life Thief. It has like a bayonet on the edge. Yo, this is sick. Sick weapon model. Shoulder pieces are dope too. They have that little three stripes on them reminds me of the mustang and this is this is it right here this is the mythic effect set look at it what is it what's the special one the repulse and then you spawn with bats around you you get some new horns called little devil i missed out on the last horns but these horns are sick 
Yo, for 2200, you also get a cross core weapon coating called Gangrel Blood. Shout out to all the people that know Gangrel from the WWF. Oh my god, this is like a purely, well, almost as black as we've gotten in the game. It's a really dark gray with hints of black and red. This is dope. The Bat Visor? Yo, is there anything in this bundle that isn't sick? You even get the black coatings as well for your weapons? And then and then what? A Devil's Backdrop. Yo, <clears throat> I think this is the first bundle in Halo Infinite where I'm like, I want everything in the bundle. For 2200 you get a lot, man. You do get a lot in this bundle. You get a legendary armor and mythic effect. You get a weapon model. You get a new helmet, chest piece, a sick-ass visor, and then cross-core coatings for both armor and weapons, plus a new backdrop. All themed after Halloween. Guys, if you want to get your Spartan Halloween costume, this is it, man. If I'm able to get my hands on 2,200 credits, I'm definitely purchasing this. This is a must-cop. This is a must-cop, guys. Must-cop. Moving on over to Pumpkin Spice, we have a Halloween hero with little bats on the armor coating. Holy crap, this is sick. I love the, uh, the texture of the undersuit. It's like, I don't even know how to describe it. It might even be like the veins of a bat's wing. If you guys have ever seen a bat... They just have a bunch of little veins on them, you know, a bunch of blood circulating through their through their wings. That's kind of like what this reminds me of. And then just with the bats on the background, dude. Oh my god, that's sick. I love it. You get this a similar coating for your weapons. It's like a purpley orange. And as you can see, I got the little grunt, the little skeleton grunt. I love what 343 has done so far this season. This is sick. Oh, look at this chest piece. You get four grenades on your chest. Yo, that is sick. And then you get these other shoulder pads. I'm sorry that I have the flame effect. I know people are going to roast me in the comment section. Why do you have effects? I can't see the shoulder pads, but check them out. I'm, an, I'm a fan of like the larger shoulder pads, but these smaller ones kind of work with Mark V Zeta. Yo, these candy corn. Oh, <laughs> I hate candy corn, but these I can rock with. There was actually a bunch of candy corn in the 343 office when I visited during Seattle, the World Championship. So clearly 343 is a fan of candy corn. I'm not, but this actually looks kind of cool. I like it. And this is kind of like a Reaper Friday the 13th nameplate, emblem, all the above. Damn, even this goes with my Spartan. I feel like they must be watching my videos. I like it, man. This is a cool bundle, too. Yo, shout out to both of these bundles. And then I guess you can get them separately? Or is this... Is, oh, this is a completely different... So this is the same coating as, like, the armor coating, but they put it separately in the shop here called Halloween Hero. For 800 credits, you get essentially one coating for all your weapons. It's a little pricey, but... Again, it's a brand new coating. They obviously put a little bit more attention to detail with the texturing as well as the little bats all over the place. So at the end of the day, you're supporting Halo Infinite. You're supporting this game to continue to be supported. So yeah, I think that was that was sick. That was sick. I ain't even gonna lie, man. That's um, this is a W week. This is a good week. Every item from that's new is dope and the fact that these items are still in the game you know you can still purchase the stuff from last week that's great as well so it gives people the opportunity to to go i kind of would like to see that going forward leave these things in the shop for maybe two weeks you know and um give people the opportunity because there's stuff from last season that they haven't returned yet that people still want so i i dig it 343 you did an amazing job this this week this is definitely the best shop of season five so far so um thank you you know i'm currently working on getting some more credits definitely going to be purchasing the entire shop like literally 2200 1600 800 2800 um over 50 bucks 
trick or treat mother truckers trick or treat mother truckers so that'll be it please if you made it this far hit like on the video subscribe to modified gaming we got a bunch of cool stuff coming we still have the podcast we have a couple play dates coming and of course schisma still working on his battle royale for halo infinite guys so stick to modified gaming don't go anywhere else and i'll catch you guys later peace out